Obama admin ordered FBI to purge 500k fugitive names from essential database list. The Obama administration was arguably the most destructive administration in all of our country's history. They were truly on the verge of ruining all of the ideals Americans hold so dear. We should all be thankful that Hillary was not able to continue to force us down that path. For eight years, Obama and the Democrats did everything in their power to undermine the rule of law as well as the rights of every law-abiding citizen. Constantly, it was clear that the priorities of the left were protecting lawbreakers at the expense of innocent Americans. Obama repeatedly looked the other way as undocumented migrants poured across the border and his DOJ ran guns to Mexican drug cartels in Operation Fast and Furious. Now it's been discovered that Obama made Americans less safe in a whole new way. A recent dispute on the proper interpretation of what a fugitive is has put the lives of countless Americans at risk. From the Daily Caller The FBI considered any person with an outstanding arrest warrant to be a fugitive. On the other hand, the Bureau of Alcohol, Tobacco, Firearms and Explosives defined a fugitive as someone who has an outstanding arrest warrant and has crossed state lines. That disagreement was settled at the end of Obama's second term, when the Justice Department's Office of Legal Counsel sided with the ATF's interpretation. Under President Donald Trump, the DOJ defined a fugitive as a person who went to another state to dodge criminal prosecution or evade giving testimony in criminal court, and implemented the Office of Legal Counsel's decision. The decision meant that around half a million fugitives were removed from the National Instant Criminal Background Check system. And yet the left says we need comprehensive background checks on gun buyers to make the system safer. No, what would really keep us safe would be if our government stopped bending over backwards to appease the people that hate us and started putting Americans first. A former DHS worker even stated that under Obama he was ordered to scrub records of Muslims with terrorist ties. Obama repeatedly made it difficult for people in the intelligence community to do their jobs, constantly undermining them and their ability to stop crimes before they occur. But his negligence towards intel wound up costing many lives, including the Pulse nightclub shooting in 2106. With a government like Obama's, Russia is not the problem, the problem, 